ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತಂ ವಂದೇ ಗುರು ಪರಂಪರ ಸಾಧನ ಟಿ ವಿ ಕೆ ಸಭಿ ದರ್ಶಕೋ ಅವರ ಭಕ್ತೋಕೋ ಮೈ ಪ್ರೇಮ್ ಐ ಎಮ್ ಆಶೀರ್ವಾದ್ ಸಾಹಿತ್ ಸ್ವಾಗತ ಕರ್ತಾ ಹೂ ಆಜ ಹಮ್ ಜೀವನ ಕಾ ಚೌತೆ ತತ್ವ ಲಾಭಾನ್ವಿತ ಕರ್ಣಿ ಕೆ ಬಾರೆ ಮೇ ಬಾತ್ ಕರುಂಗಾ ಬಾತ್ ಕರೆಂಗೆ ಲಾಭಾನ್ವಿತ ಕರ್ಣಿ ಕೆ ತತ್ವ ಸೆ ಆಪ ಕೈಸೆ ಸ್ವಯಂ ಕೆ ಸಾತ್ ಐವಂ ದೂಸ್ರೋನ್ ಕೆ ಸಾತ್ ಸಂಬಂಧ ಕೋ ವಿಸ್ತಾರಿತ ಕರ ಸಕ್ತೆ ಹೈ ಇಸ್ಕೆ ಬಾರೆ ಮೇ ಆಜ ಹಮ್ ಬಾತ್ ಕರೆಂಗೆ ಐ ಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಟುಡೇ ಆನ್ ದ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಪ್ರಿನ್ಸಿಪಲ್ of life enriching how it expands your relationship with you and with others dhyan se suniye first of all you need to understand enriching is the only possible way you can relate with the universe with others which can expand you also you can relate with others in so many ways through lust through fear through confusion through attention need from them jealousy through jealousy with them at thread you can relate with others in so many ways but nothing is going to expand you make you powerful like the method of enriching you relating with others the basic principle should be enriching basic principle through which you relate with others should be enriching pehli jo baat aapko samajhni chahiye wah hai ki labanvit karna hi ek marg hai jisse aap swayam se ayam puri duniya se jud sakte hai ordinary human beings relate with others in so many mode mode of lust mode of fear mode of confusion mode of jealousy mode of attention need i tell you the best way to relate with others which will make you powerful which will make you expanding which will complete you is enriching whether it is the relationship with others or relationship with god it has to be from the attitude of enriching you may ask how can we enrich god your creativity can enrich god listen your creativity is always your contribution to the cosmos it is something which was not there in the cosmos you created it you expanded it you expressed it for you to express your creativity 
whatever is needed may be was there in the cosmos but putting all of them together allowing the alchemy of creativity happening and sharing it enriching it is your contribution best life on the planet earth is alchemy of creativity whether you look at you or look at others look at everything with this one angle how can i enrich when you look at you how can i enrich me you are healed with you you will be completely comfortable with you same way if you look at others how can i enrich them how can i enrich them i tell you you will experience advaita just with this one attitude listen sabse uttam uttam mark jise aap dusron ke sath jud sakte hai jo aapko शक्तिशाली और लाभान्वित कर सकता है वह एक चौथा तत्व स्वयं और दूसरों को लाभान्वित करना है यू रिलेटिंग विथ अदर्स द बेसिक प्रिंसिपल्स दैट यू रिलेट विथ अदर्स शुड बी एनरिचिंग दूसरों के साथ संबंधित होने का बुनियादी सिद्धांत दूसरों को लाभान्वित करना होना चाहिए अब केवल मानक मानव को ही नहीं भगवान को भी लाभान्वित कर सकते सत्य है अब भगवान से अपनी सृजात्मक सृजात्मकता सृजात्मकता सॉरी सृजनात्मकता से लाभान्वित कर सकते हैं क्रिएटिविटी इज यूर कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन टू द होल सेट विथ दिस वन एटीट्यूड ऑफ एनरिचिंग विथ यू आर विथ द वर्ल्ड लेट दिस वन एटीट्यूड एनरिचिंग be the way to relate sadharan manushya dusro ke sath anek tariko dwara sambandhit hai vasna bhai brahm irsha parantu dusro ke sath sabse acha sambandh hai samriddhi जो आपको शक्तिशाली विस्तारित संपूर्ण बनाती है वन ऑफ द इंपॉर्टेंट ट्रूथ्स अबाउट द लाइफ यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड एंड कॉन्टेम्पलेट इन रिचिंग अदर्स कॉन्स्टेंटली एक्सपैंड यूर पॉसिबिलिटीज ऑफ लाइफ enriching others constantly expands the possibilities of your life whether you are doing a business you are doing some job or your relationship in the family your relationship in the society friends in every line every dimension when you live with the principle of enriching your life goes so beautifully so smoothly so strongly jeevan ka ek 
प्रमुख सत्य जो आपको समझनी चाहिए वह है दूसरों को लाभान्वित करना लगातार आपके जीवन में उपस्थित संभावनाओं को विस्तारित करती है चाहे वो कोई भी कार्य हो आपका व्यापार आपके परिवार के संबंध हो इत्यादि डायमेंशन ऑफ लाइफ यू वांट एक्सपेंशन इन रिचिंग कैन डू आई कैन गिव यू वन हंड्रेड एग्जांपल्स सी व्हेन वी स्पीक अबाउट सम प्रिंसिपल्स rarely works you need to think and give example but when i speak about the principle on which the cosmos is functioning everything is example for the principle i am talking enriching others empowers you completes you fulfills you i do not need to think and bring examples from somewhere everything happening in the life is example for these principles jeevan ki koi bhi kshetra mein vriddhi pana hai pane ke liye ye tatva upyogi hoga जब आप समृद्धि इस तत्व के साथ जीते हैं तब आपके रिश्ते आसान एवं दृढ़ता सहित बांधते हैं फर्स्ट थिंग यू नीड टू डू इन यूर लाइफ इज फाइंड सम लुब्रिकेशन इन यूर इन साइड थिंकिंग when your inside thinking is constantly irritated there is so much of friction in your inside thinking for example if you are thinking why should i constantly enrich others when nobody cares for me yes you may have a very logical supporting facts figures evidences for your argument but those arguments are only going to be like a grinding wheel on your inner space creating so much of friction grinding you literally eating parts of you but that is not going to solve the issue ध्यान से सुनिए यू मे हैव सो मेनी फैक्ट्स फिगर्स एविडेंसेस वर्ल्ड इज प्लेस यू कैन कलेक्ट एविडेंस फॉर एनी केस यू क्रिएट इट डज नॉट नीड टू बी ट्रू एनी थिंग यू वॉन्ट यू कैन क्रिएट एविडेंस फॉर इट you can create evidence for the statement everything is god and you can create evidence for the statement everything is devil you can create evidence for both it depends on you for which you want to create evidence sabhe pehle aapko अपनी अंदर की सबसे पहले आपको अपनी अंदर की सोचने के ढंग और विचारधारा में परिवर्तन लाना ये चाहिए लानी चाहिए सबसे पहले आपको अपनी अंदर की सोचने का ढंग और विचार दारा में परिवर्तन लाना चाहिए
पहले एक आवश्यक है कि आप अपनी सोच में से घर्षण को हटा दे हटा दे रिमूव द फ्रिक्शन फ्रॉम यूर थिंकिंग वेन यू हैव द थिंकिंग वाई शुड आई एन रिच अदर्स वेन दे डोंट इवन दे आर नॉट इवन रेडी टू रिसीव वट आई एम गिविंग वेन दे आर नॉट इवन रेडी टू बी सेंसिटिव you can go on go on go on but i tell you with this friction you will only be shrinking in your life because friction naturally makes your thinking shrink you will be shrinking in your thinking also you will not take up expansive new adventures expressing your possibility friction puts so much of negativity in your thinking you will not even reach the space of positivity the first step you need to reach for success is positivity then space of possibility then space of leadership then space of enlightenment space of positivity is the space of devatas space of possibility is the space of indra space of ishwaratva is the space of vaikuntha kailasa space of enlightenment is the nirvana moksha understand only if you remove friction in your thinking the space of positivity happens ye sangarsh se आप केवल संकुचित होंगे संघर्ष आपको विस्तारित होने की संभावना से वंचित रखता है इसीलिए आपकी सोचने के ढंग से पहले संघर्ष को निकाल दीजिए रिमूव फ्रिक्शन फ्रॉम यूर थिंकिंग if you start your day with the attitude of enriching first of all you need to be convinced why should you enrich life happens to you with others you can be a good mother only when your son is complete with you as mother only when your husband is complete with you as husband you can be good wife only when your father and mother are complete with you as a good son or daughter you will be good son or daughter only when your employee is complete with you as boss you will be a good boss only when your boss is complete with you as a good employee you will be good employee understand every identity you carry in your life will become complete if the other end is complete for example if you are carrying identity of mother your son is the other end if you are carrying the identity of son your father is the other end if you are carrying the identity of employee your boss is the other end if you are carrying the identity of the boss your employee is the other end only the other end is complete you can be complete unfortunately you come to the conclusion before even start enriching them they can never be complete you don't know my boss anybody can be complete in the planet earth not him 
Till I make 25 company and giving me is not going to be complete. You start with so much of negative possibility. You never reach and you never even take first step. Up, up, na har din dusron ko laban with karne ki mano bhavna se aram ki jiye kyon ki keval anya log ki log hi aapki asli astitva ka pratik hai. Listen, you can never be complete till the other end is complete and making the other end complete is not complicated job. You just need to remove the friction inside you, you carry about the other end. When you remove the friction inside, the other end is healed. When you add lubrication in your heart, the other end is automatically healed. Lubrication you need to add inside the heart is the attitude of enriching. With attitude of enriching, even in your business, you will feel so fulfilled. For example, if you are doing the business of selling shirts, Do it with the attitude of enriching, with integrity and authenticity. Don't cheat the quality material. Have the right price, right price for the product. For example, if you are selling the shirt for 100 rupee, you know very clearly, even if somebody is having 100 rupees, they cannot wear that 100 rupee. They need somebody to make cotton, thread, dye it and weave it and stitch it and bring it here. So converting that 100 rupee into shirt itself is an enriching. So every business you do can be enriching directly. If you are with the attitude of enriching, suddenly so much of friction in you melts down. You are complete with whatever profession you are doing. I tell you, I have met so many CEOs, heads of companies, business magnates. None of them are complete about the business they are doing. They carry such a deep guilt because they feel they are cheating everybody. Their business is based on cheating. Anybody I talk, they say, Swamiji, this integrity, authenticity can be practiced in other fields. In my field, it is impossible, Swamiji. In my field, morning, the moment I get up, till night, I have to tell lies, 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 lies. I have to be cheating. How can I be? I tell you, you are not bigger than cosmos. When cosmos can function with this principle of enriching, you can. You just need to have right understanding and right attitude. Many CEOs, heads of the corporate companies, Try to give me donation. They fund some of my our social service activities. Many times I deny, I don't accept. I tell them, no. They ask, why Swamiji? We are giving you donation, why are you saying no? I tell them, first, you heal the, the incompletion you are carrying that your business is cheating. Because of that guilt, you are donating. When you donate out of incompletion, you will try to rule my organization. Tomorrow, you will try to put your nose inside my organization because 
you carry the deep incompletion that you are exploiting or cheating people tomorrow you will put the same doubt on me i tell them first complete the pattern you are carrying with the right understanding everything is enriching with right understanding everybody is enriching you just need to have understanding and shift in your cognition simply your actions will transform your way of cognizing will transform आपका हर व्यापार आपको सीधे लाभान्वित कर सकता है जब पूरा ब्रह्मांड इन चार तत्वों के साथ काम कर सकता है तो आप भी कर सकते हैं आप केवल तभी पूर्ण हो सकते हैं जब आपके साथ रहने वाले अन्य लोगों के साथ आप पूर्णत्व की स्थिति को अनुभव करें दूसरों के साथ पूर्णत्व स्थिति को लाना अति सरल है जब आप दूसरों के साथ पूर्णत्व अनुभव कर सकते हैं तब आप में संघर्ष सरलता से पिघल जाता है you need to understand enriching adds so much to your inner space only when you enrich the people in the other end only when the people in the other end are complete you can be complete you always think people in the without completing the people in the other end you can become complete it may be irresponsible retirement not responsible completion dhyan se suniye only when each one of my disciple are complete i am complete as guru before my disciples are complete if i try to be complete it can be retirement it cannot be completion withdrawal is not completion it can be irresponsible retirement now millions of you are watching me through the sadhana tv when i make each one of you understand what i am saying only then i am a speaker teacher only when all of you are complete in what you are listening i am a teacher till i complete the other end i cannot be a complete teacher jab aap दूसरों को लाभान्वित करते हैं तभी वो पूर्ण होते हैं तभी आप पूर्ण होते हैं कॉन्स्टेंटली विदाउट इवन गेटिंग इन टू द लाइफ अप्लाइंग दिस प्रिंसिपल्स यू कम टू द कंक्लूशन एंड you decide this cannot be practiced keval jab aapke aas paas rehne wale sabhi log aap se purnatva sthiti ko anubhav kar sakte hai aap swayam ke sath bhi purnatva sthiti ko anubhav kar sakte hai when your mother is complete you will be complete जब आपकी माता जी आपके साथ पूर्णत्व का अनुभव करेंगे तभी आप एक 
बेटी होने के लिए पूर्णत्व का अनुभव करेंगे अच्छी तरह से जान लीजिए हर कोई पहचान जो आप अपनाते हैं अपनाते हैं जब दूसरा छोर पूर्णत्व की स्थिति में होगा तभी आप भी पूर्णत्व की स्थिति को पाएंगे अनलेस द अदर एंड इज कंप्लीट यू कैन नॉट बी कंप्लीट एनी अटेम्प्ट यू डू टू बिकम कंप्लीट बाय योर सेल्फ विदाउट कंप्लीटिंग द अदर एंड विल बी ओनली irresponsible retirement never be responsible completion try try to apply this principle start thinking from the angle of enriching others you will see completing others how easy it is because everyone is waiting to complete you if you are feeling incomplete with somebody be very clear they are also feeling incomplete with you when you want to complete them they are waiting to complete you nobody is here to exploit you nobody is here to cheat you people who think they are cheating others they are very cunning that they can cheat others are only cheating themselves i tell you with attitude of cunningness you will never be expanding the possibility of expanding will never be cherished by the inner space which goes through the friction of incompletion friction of incompletion constantly makes you shrink 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 the way each of my sanyasis declare about their plan through which they are going to enrich others the way they declare i know do they carry friction inside or not if you are carrying friction inside i tell you the expansion is not possible expansion even in your thinking is not possible add the lubrication of enriching attitude in your being yadi aapke bitar sangarshan hai to aap mein vistar sambhav nahi hai vistarit hone ka sambhavna aapke antar संकुचित होने का और संघर्ष अनुभव करने की जागा को परिवर्तन कर देता है एस लॉन्ग एस आई वॉज थिंकिंग द वर्ल्ड इज आउट देर टू चीट मी आई वॉज ओनली श्रिंकिंग लिजन the moment i realized my decision to enrich myself and others is going to be the life of completion the moment i decided to live the principle of enriching even my sanyas felt like being a king i tell you when i was 14 till from my 14 to 17 i suffered with this attitude 
world is out there to cheat me. Even when I was in the house, I felt like a poor beggar. Seventeen and a half, I left the house, but with the completion and the attitude of enriching myself and others, even though I was a beggar from seventeen and a half to twenty-five, I felt and lived only like a king. I went on enriching people. Even though I never had anything in my hand, I was dependent even more for my meal, for my food and stay, for clothes on others. I tell you, I lived like king. I went to different monasteries, different ashrams, different places, lived my life, but I lived, I felt I am a king. And I saw I was only adding whoever came in my breathing space. I might have received food and clothes, but I have contributed, added so much to people, I only felt fulfilled. I only felt expanded. Jab me parivraj ka jivan ji rahata me dusro par apni avashyak tao ki liye nirbarta parantu me ek raja ki tara ji rahata. I lived like a king even though I have to be dependent on my food, even for my food and clothes to others. Aaj ki satsang ka sarans hai lagatar swayam ko aivam anya logon ko laban vit karte rahiye tabhi aap aapne antar aivam bahar hone wale koi bhi sangarsh ko mitha सकते हैं और स्वयं को एवं दूसरों को विस्तारित कर सकते हैं जीवन मुक्ति प्रदम देवम क्षमा पूर्णम जगत गुरु वंदे परम हम साख्यम नित्यानंदाय स्वागतम आनंदानुभवा स्वादम सर्व रोग वंदे पाप विनाशक्त निनंदय स्वागत आनंदुभवा स्वरम सर्वोग निवारक वंदे पाप विनाशक्त